Auntie, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Brandy Giz, and I'm back with another video. Today I decided to do another video for you guys. I have a haul from Alta. I picked up some items during the um, 21 day sale. They still have it going on. Um, I'm not sure if some of the products that I picked up are still available, but you might want to check your Alta and see. But anyway, um, yeah, I went to Ulta and I picked up some Dose of Color lip glosses. And I also picked up another um, NYX. You can't get enough of these. NYX, these are the Micro Brow Pencil. And the shade that I picked up is an Espresso. I'm always picking this up. I think I picked up two. This is the pencil. And I just like to do my brows with those. So I like to have them everywhere so that I don't run out. Okay on with the haul okay so I picked up one two three four five six I picked up seven lip glosses one I gave to my co-worker and what's funny is she came back the next day with a bag and she uh, blessed me with a lip gloss so let me slow down I'm going too fast because I'm excited. I love lip glosses. If you don't know me, now you know. I am a lip gloss lover. So let me show you what I picked up. I picked up Happy Hour. I'm not going to do swatches. I did swatches on my blog that I just uploaded. So if you want to see swatches, you might want to go over and check that out. But this is Happy Hour. That's it right there, and let me swatch Happy Hour for you all. A really pretty shade. It's like a coral, kind of like coral, peachy like. It's more so coral. And these Dose of Color lip glosses were on sale for ten bucks, which is great because I think they're either nineteen or twenty dollars, and I like those. And this is another one. It's called Spill the Deets. And this is more so of a mauve color. Let's spill the deets. That's it right there. We have Messy Bun. And this is also like a pinky mauve color. think I swatched these on my channel but if you want to see swatches thumbs this video up and I will do it for you guys but if you don't if I don't get enough thumbs up I will not do the video and this one is one of my favorites it's called Dolly and it's a pink like a more on the pink lavender side and I'll swatch this one it's like really my favorite and it's pretty with uh, it's pretty with uh, a liner like plum or prune from NYX. Okay, and then we have a then we have the shade Can You Not, and it is a nude. And I definitely definitely need a lip liner with that. That's it right there. And I have another dolly that I picked up because I picked up two dollies because I was in love with them. And my friend from work, Talisa, she picked up Can You Not for me. So I appreciate that. And, and I have more. Alrighty, moving on. I was experiencing a lot of like acne right here in this area and I was working out a lot so I wanted to look up the Dermatologica. I've heard great things about it and I do use Mario Badescu. I wanted to see how the Dermalogica line worked out so I picked up this starter kit um, because I was going to pick up like the, the bottles. I think it's like $60 and $50. Dermatologica is not cheap so uh the young lady suggested that i try the starter kit and so i although i do use um what is that mario badescu the acne facial wash it works but i'm still getting 
uh, breakout so I'm assuming that my skin is getting used to the Mario so I'm gonna move on and probably revisit that later but right now I'm gonna try this out and it's the Dermatologica breakout clearing skin kit and it comes with a foaming wash a hydration lotion and a breakout clearing booster and let me open that I can't remember how much this was let me see I have my receipt right here let's see the Dermatologica kit was $28.50 and it comes in a pouch like so all right and so it looks like this like I said this is like deep cleanse and purifies it says use daily a.m. and p.m. and then we have this I guess you put this on when you have acne and this is the what is it soothing hydrating relief and it says use daily it moisturizes and it's plant-based and it has hyaluronic acid to provide instant relief of skin dehydration and all that good stuff and for me purchasing the product she threw in a lot of samples this is the fall skin refresh dermatological this is like the age smart And it comes with a dynamic skin recovery, a primer, and a power firm. Here's another one. It's a age reform nutrient charge water gel. She also threw that in. And I haven't read up on them. What else did she throw in? Some kind of cold plasma face. I, I think it's called Paracone. I might not be saying that right. She threw in a lot of samples. She also threw in the L'Oreal, it's the Pure Clay Cleanser. And the last item is a Garnier Skin Active Micellar Water. I always use this to take my makeup off. So here's a mini, like a travel size. And I stopped at NYX, they have that in the mall at Woodfield. And I wanted to try out their primer it's called the can't stop won't stop and I've been using this for a good minute I want to say about a week now and so far it's pretty pretty good I used it on today and I do get oily as you can see my skin as you can see my face I haven't blocked right here is pretty oily but I'm not as oily as I normally would be so that's a good thing this is a matte primer and I figured I'd get something that was cheaper than the Becca. I want to test it out and this is it right here. And let me show you guys. This is a comes out like so. And you just rub it in. And when I sampled it in the store, I noticed that it got uh, real tacky, which was a good thing. And you could feel it instantly it gets matte so I like that kind of stuff I picked up three more items I picked up a lip liner from NYX and the name of it is uh, slide on glide on stay on definitely it's a turn on waterproof extreme lip color and the shade that I picked up is called urban cafe and it's like a brown so I'll swatch that for you guys and I also picked up a lipstick and you guys know that I always open up my lippies. So, and I try them on in the car. I don't know about this plastic, but this lipstick is called Boardwalk. And it is like a pretty nude shade. And I'll swatch that next to that lip liner. That is Boardwalk. And the last item that I picked up is, I think this is Peanut Brittle. Yep, this is the Intense Butter Lip Gloss. I try on um, the lip gloss, which was, let me think of the name of it. And this one is Peanut Brittle. This is also a pretty, pretty nude. I tried on the one that um, I've been hearing a lot about, but when I swatched it on my lips, it didn't look good at all. It, when I tried it on, it didn't look good with my skin tone. I think, in my opinion, it's for someone that's lighter. 
I can't remember the name of it, but I'll list it right here. So I moved. I didn't. I didn't want that. So yeah, I stopped in Walmart and I picked up some items that I figured I'd share with you all since they're beauty related. I wanted to pick up some more uh, concealers. These are like my favorite concealers at the moment, and they're from Maybelline. It's the Instant Age Rewind eraser of dark circles i picked up the shade tan and i picked up caramel and i also like golden for a highlight underneath so these are like i said my favorite and then i seen then i picked up some more lashes from uh salon perfect and they're called the clusters number 615s and these are it right there and I also picked up some ones I've never seen before and these are number 652s and it's like a three pack and it says it's like luxurious layered volume I like that I don't know where I think I stopped I, I don't know I think I got this from either Walmart or Target and this is the elf plumping and I've had this before for some reason I end up picking it up and this is another like lip plumper and it's from Elf. And it's called Pink Cosmo. And it looks really sheer, but it gives a nice little plumping. I'm like in love with plumping stuff. And I know a lot of you all hate plumping items, but I love them. Okay, and then we have the um, beauty supply store. Let me show y'all. I purchased two lippies from the beauty supply store. I had one like sitting right here. I don't know what I did with it, but this one is called Bellini. It was like $5.99, and it is so pretty. Look at that. It's like a metallic, long-lasting matte. And... I would have to like dock this up. I just can't wear it by itself. I would have to put on um, a lip liner with it. And that is it. I would definitely have to put on a lip liner with it and then I would like top it with a really pretty, a really. I would top it with a really pretty lippy, like a lip gloss on top. Let me see, what did I do with that? I got so much stuff on here guys. And then I picked up, all right, and this is like one of my favorites. I need to go and get the new one. I really don't need any lip gloss, but this is like one of my favorites. And this is the Ruby Kisses, and I'm all close up in your face. But this is the Ruby Kisses Delicious, and it's the um, Mango Butter and Aki Berry. The shade is called Cotton, Cotton Candy. It is so pretty on. And I had this on in my, uh, I think the Sephora video that I just uploaded. But it is so pretty. I like that. And they had a new, I wanted to get the new, but I was like, I'm doing too much. So I'm definitely going to go back and get that new. I won't feel right unless I get it. Oh, and the last thing that I picked up at Walmart is this Rim Pure Deto Detoxifying Charcoal Body Wash. I heard of this. If you have, let me know what you think of this product. They had different scents, but... This one smelled the, the best, and if you guys tried this, let me know down in the comment section. All right, guys, so that will complete my video. I thank you all for watching. Don't forget to comment on this video. Thumbs this video up if you liked it, if you've seen some things that you, um, that you use. Thumbs it up. Let me know down in the comment section what you thought about the video. Until then, God bless. Bye.